Basic Microbiology, a laboratory manual. Testing effectiveness of disinfectants and antiseptics by disc diffusion method. Introduction, antiseptic, kills microorganism on body. Disinfectant, kills microorganism on non-living surface. List of disinfectants and antiseptics. Disinfectants, phenolics, 5%, chlorohexidine, mercury compounds, sodium hypochlorite, formaldehyde, and ethylene oxide. Antiseptics, phenolics, 1%, chlorohexidine, hydrogen peroxide, dyes, crystal violet, ethanol and propanol, silver nitrate. Methods, disc diffusion method, modified use dilution method. Test effectiveness of disinfectant against a particular organism. Test effectiveness of a disinfectant on a surface. Disc diffusion method. Purpose. Assess effectiveness of disinfectants and antiseptics against selected organisms. Principle. Effective disinfectant or antiseptic will inhibit the growth of microorganism on agar plate forming zone of inhibition. For each group, provide four triptychase soy broth tubes, first containing Escherichia coli, second containing Staphylococcus aureus, third containing Pseudomonas aeruginosa, and fourth containing Bacillus subtilis. Prepare a standardized inoculum, 1.5 to 5 times 10 to the power 8 CFU per ml in a sterile saline. 0.5 McVarland standard or direct microscopic count can be used. Streak plate, aseptically immerse a sterile cotton swab in the bacterial suspension. Squeeze against walls of tube. Streak swab vertically and horizontally and on the rim of the TSA plate. Cover and allow to stand for 5 to 10 minutes. For each group, provide 4 25 ml beakers with 10 ml of tested disinfectants or antiseptics. Puncture this from different color papers. Use color as a label code. Using insulated forceps, immerse this into corresponding disinfectant or antiseptic for 15 seconds. Drain this on tissue paper immediately prior to placing on agar plate. Applying this. Aseptically, place immersed dust 20 mm from rim and from each other on the corresponding plate. Incubate in an inverted position at 37 degrees centigrade for 24 hours. Measure zone of inhibition. Next day, measure zones of inhibition around discs. Ruler should cross the center of the disc for correct measurement. Size of zone of inhibition is not indicative of degree of effectiveness of disinfectant or antiseptic. Calibers may be used. Use this form to report results.